Turning Round 3, Algo Ruby, this brand new documentary series just dropped on Netflix called Gunther's Million. And this documentary, I guess it is based on, look, it is a true story. And when I saw that, like this documentary is coming on Netflix, I was like, oh, really? Netflix, you are making a documentary on this dog? Uh, who's worth i think it's according to this documentary series it's worth like 150 million dollar or something like that and as i was watching this documentary well i find this documentary story itself quite interesting i suppose uh because a lot of people we know uh, like in real life you know uh, people are so rich sometimes uh, and uh, they don't have anybody especially in here you know a lot of people are rich like that they don't have anybody they just have a dog or a cat but leaving a dog all oh, this million million dollar it was really ridiculous when you hear the story especially really they don't have anybody in their family how about distance cousin or anybody in germany like nobody is there uh that means us, of course this documentary do ex try to explain how this dog inherited all this million dollar uh and how all this million dollar trust went to marijo i think his name is from italy uh and this show it, it was like like it started out uh, the way it starts out like are you kidding me netflix what the heck am i watching all this thing it's showing you i was like i was really uh like giving up on this documentary as going to turn out then okay so as the story went on maybe the story itself as i was saying is a little interesting i guess uh, because i wanted to know how this dog uh, inherited and he inherited long time ago it's 1995 this dog uh, came with all this like uh, money and uh, i'm just gonna explain how did this dog get all this money so it looks like this pharmaceutical company owner he came from germany and uh like he had this pharmaceutical company which worth so much money and uh like they this couple he, they came from germany and uh uh after the husband died i guess the wife who had a son and looks like the son was uh, like uh, suffering from this depression and uh he committed suicide so after he committed suicide the wife decided uh to leave all her money to this dog Gunther again they don't have anybody <laughs> uh, and then somehow I guess uh, this uh, like Gunther's trustee comes to this guy in Italy his name is Marijo and we see how Marijo he comes across with this trustee and uh, he also have a wife in this show and we see how his wife and him takes over this trustee and how they are managing all this million dollar and we see this show actually talks about how uh gunther who is this uh oh i never realized this actually is like this is a german shepherd dog and they want to keep continuing his bloodline so it's going on and on and uh, they show uh, the overall this documentary what do i think about it okay so here is the thing i think this documentary is uh, interesting learning about as i was saying many people are like that you know they don't have nobody they leave their stuff to cat or dog it does happen in real life so it's not an extraordinary thing however this documentary all this extra thing they added all these people they come on and tell their personal story it's like what well, do i care about them no i don't i do not care about how did he become spokesperson and how did she become this or he become this i do not care any of this thing i don't know how the hell is this documentary has five episodes it's too long the story just drags on like this i was like just yeah, stop it stop i don't have like this kind nobody has time to watch five episodes of this documentary so this documentary obviously they're stressed out a lot to tell all this story about maricho and i was like <laughs> And David was really getting tired of it. All the things he was doing is going on boat, all this like women and all this thing. This documentary was really tasteless when you watch it. And uh, I, I don't know, I, I didn't like it at all. It was really like <laughs> ridiculous. I was I, like, are you kidding me? <laughs> That's what I was thinking. Uh, but still, I think this documentary first episode is definitely like still it has so many unnecessary scenes like i i just wish at this point they redo it who sign off this
this documentary like with the four episodes it's too long too dragged out nobody cared about all this story uh that means that of course uh i thought it was an okay story uh and i thought it was too long too dragged out uh of the story itself is interesting and that was my thought on this let me know in the comment what do you think about this documentary and if you're about this video don't share my other videos on other netflix documentary series if you enjoyed this please subscribe until i see you next time please take care